Hi, it's Teresa from Dodge Nature Center, and time for another Nature to Go. Have you ever been walking along a tree-lined path? So lots of evergreens around you, and all of a sudden you start to notice the ground is covered with something. You're not quite sure what they are, and the closer you walk towards the trees, you realize that they're scales of some kind. In fact, they're scales from pine cones, What on earth is going on here? What you're seeing is the handiwork of red squirrels. Now, these are the squirrels that are slightly smaller than the gray squirrels that we're used to seeing. And they love to collect pine cones and then take them apart in order to get to the seeds that are inside. Maybe you've heard red squirrels and just didn't realize that's what you were hearing. They make this chittering sound in order to warn others out of their territory. Red squirrels are active all winter long, and to prepare for winter, they start collecting pine cones in late summer and caching them in what's called a midden, M-I-D-D-E-N. And this is basically a big pile of those torn apart pine cones that they're able to bury fresh pine cones in. This keeps them from drying out, which would open up the scales and let the seeds escape. And they don't want that to happen because the seeds are what they want to eat. Besides the pine cones, they may hide other kinds of food in their middens, including things like acorns. And so The red squirrels tend to be very territorial because they don't want any other squirrels coming along and taking food from their stockpile, which they're relying on for the winter. So the next time you're out walking in the woods, stop and listen. Look around and see if you can spot the red squirrel. Can you spot where it's been busy eating pine cones? Can you find its midden? There's a lot to notice about red squirrels when you're out in the woods. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Nature to Go. Look for those red squirrels, and we'll talk to you again next time.